Well, hello everyone. This is your girl Ursula Living and I'm coming to you today to do a December favorites haul. And I don't have a whole bunch of things to uh, present to you guys this month, but I'm pretty sure uh, for the month of January that I'm going to have quite a few things to show you guys. So stay tuned for that. But in the meantime, let's just enjoy what we have, right? So, as you know, December was Christmas time, and uh, a lot of us, we go shopping for those good-smelling candles or those little uh, wax melts that you put on, like, those Scentsy candle wax melt things, you know? Well, I found some. They weren't Scentsy, but they are made by Fe Febreze, and it was a limited edition because, of course, it was um, Christmas, and it's called Sugared cranberry and let me just open it up of course it just comes just like this as you guys can see and uh, so you get one two yep six and you just basically take these I know you know what Scentsy is and they have these in stores too but you know the little oil warmers or candle warmer wax milk things I don't know what the exact thing is stick it on there and makes your house smell great and this is the uh, packaging for that let me tell you guys I don't know how you guys are I know we're all about saving the earth nowadays but I love the smell of a real Christmas tree and I haven't had a real Christmas tree in forever and we were thinking about getting one this year but we didn't so hopefully maybe next year we'll get a real Christmas tree. I just like having real Christmas trees because a real Christmas tree for the holidays because it smells like Christmas. Like it just reminds me of Christmas. It's like Christmas tree smell. And that's exactly what these uh, sugar cranberry Febreze wax melts smell like. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas. Okay, or whatever the song says, right? But this is an awesome, awesome thing. I don't remember the pricing on this, but we had this going all through Christmas. And even when my mom came down, she thought like we had a real Christmas tree in the house and we didn't. <laughs> it just smelled like a Christmas tree. I could actually smell this all year long. Moving on, the next thing I'm going to talk about is, as you guys have seen, which I'm going to be doing a video right after this video, so you're going to see me in the same outfit, so don't be talking about me, but this is the um, Insanity Max 30. I got this at the very beginning of December and have been doing it since then, um, actually tomorrow. I don't know when all this is going to post, but tomorrow, which is Friday the 12th, I'm sorry. When is Friday? Friday is going to, Friday is the 9th. Friday is, is the 9th. Um, it's going to be my last month of month one, and then I'll be moving into month two. And yes, I'm going to be doing a... Uh, video explaining what Insan Insanity Max 30 is and talking about it right after this video so that's what I'm doing um, now but I'll go into more into it at that time but this has been my boo for December like big time if you're into working out or you're into just wanting to work out at home and do all that look at him look at him So that has been definitely my best friend because I'm still using it now. So it'll probably even be a next month's favorite. Another thing that I've been using in conjunction with Insanity Max 30 is a Avocare product. And yes, I'm an Avocare distributor. But I wanted to mention this product and it's my favorite because this product, um, it's called O2 Gold. And it is my first time taking this product uh, from the Performance Elite line with Avocare. 
I knew that I was getting back in, into um, Insanity Max 30. I had done the regular Insanity before, and it is tough, guys. It's definitely not easy. So I wanted something. Um, I take another product as well called Catalyst, which I can go over in a different video. But I knew I needed something to help get me, give me that extra oomph through the workout. And I'm not someone who likes to drink a whole lot of liquid or protein shakes while I'm working out. Just because as I'm working out, especially in a program like Insanity Max 30, you're going from the floor to the to the ceiling, to the floor, jumping around, doing all this stuff. And so whenever I drink stuff and work out, it makes me feel a little, like, not cool. Um, but anyway, with Insanity Max 30, um, I started taking this O2 Gold. And just to read you exactly what it says, so you know that I'm not making anything up, it says O2 Gold is a supplement enhanced supplement enhances the body's use of oxygen supporting peak performance and endurance at any activity level and you take two like an hour before you know you're going to work out and it definitely helps me through my workout it helps me to last longer my endurance you know to last longer which therefore means if i'm able to last longer that means i'm able to push harder and maximize my results with my workouts and so this is a really really great product from the Avacare uh, elite line and one thing that i want to mention about uh, a lot of the Avacare products is that um, we use informed choice i don't know if you guys can see that but informed choice and that just basically means that um, these products were tested for any illegal or harmful um, substances and banned substances. We have a lot of athletes that use our products. Um, and I just got word that um, the basically Major League Soccer is endorsing, like they're, those players are going to be using Avacare products this coming season. So I'm totally excited and pumped up about that. And that's just letting you know that the that the, um, I'm sorry, that the product is safe. So I just wanted to throw that in there because I know a lot of people, when you talk about supplements and all that kind of stuff when you're working out and you're pushing yourself like in a program like Insanity Max 30, you have to be careful what you're um, inputting into your body. So this is definitely safe. On the days that I don't take this, I definitely see a difference in my endurance and in my workout. So definitely when I take this, I am on point, and you better be when you messing with Shanti. Y'all know that's my boo, right? Y'all know he like M&Ms, right? Like me, peanut M&Ms? I'm just saying. All right. So the next thing I want to talk about is nail polish, which, by the way, I don't know if you could tell, but, like, this nail polish I have on is the bomb.com. I'm just saying. But one nail polish that I really, really enjoyed for the holidays, and I actually saw, let me get this name right on YouTube, um, Makeup and Beauty Junkie. Uh, she had posted this on her Facebook page, and it is a Essie nail polish, and the exact name is Jingle High, Jingle Low. Jingle High, Jingle Low, get it on your funky toe. I'm not gonna <laughs> swipe this but it's really like a it's not glittery but it looks like kind of metallic silver goldish kind of color and um, I don't even know if y'all can see that but I'm not going to swipe it oh wait maybe I can hold on you don't see that? There you go. That's a really, really cool, festive kind of color. Um, I would actually wear this um, anytime. I'm a girl that I don't go by the rules, like wear white, you know, before Labor Day, after Labor Day, all that kind of stuff. I just go with, like, I'm a rebel when it comes to that kind of stuff. So I definitely would wear this anytime, but I just thought that this was a really, really cool color. Um, especially during the holiday season and for New Year's. So it's a really cool color. All right, 
The next two things I'm going to talk about is the um, Mary Kay eyeshadow, and I hope that I'm going to be able to swipe this okay. But um, Mary Kay uses mineral eye colors, and this one is called Rose Gold. And it's just a good base color, in between color, or a color that you can put all over your your um, eyes. And oops, looks like that. And see, it kind of. Let me see. Let me do this a little bit better. See if I. Gonna swipe it a couple times. See if. We, yeah, like that was for nothing. You guys definitely can't see that, can you? Because it's right there. No, you can't. I'm sorry. My camera's not allowing me to show it to you. But this is definitely the color. Um, maybe I can. Um, take a picture of it, but I have been like wearing this color like crazy and I had forgot I had it and so Definitely a, a great color for your base or a good color to go um, In between but definitely a good um, On the lid color The next thing I splurged in December and bought me a Becca Cosmetics highlighter and I have the opal and they have besides opal maybe four or five other colors now let me tell you guys I learned a lot from Instagram I've told you guys that before I learned a lot from Instagram and this I learned about on Instagram and I've been highlighting the heck out of my face yeah and you only need a little bit and it's not showing up maybe I could try and take a picture of it but um, you only need a little bit of it and see that was too much let me blend that in see that the camera's not showing up good today can y'all see that but anyway, it's a really, really good highlighter. Go on Instagram and look up Becca Cosmetics and you will see all the different colors. Um, another good color that I hear people raving about, uh, especially for women of color, is I think it's Topaz. But you can wear pretty much, I feel, any woman of any color can wear any of these highlighters it just depends on how you like your highlighter to look but what I have noticed from reviews and from people wearing it is that um, if you're not sure you don't want to get something too light too dark um, opal is a pretty good one to go with for anybody okay the next two items are hair items and I'm going to go through them really quickly because I've already talked about them before. The first one is Curl Junkie Pattern Pusha, 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 Push Them Curls. Now this stuff is really, really good. I'm going to do a actual review on this product very, very soon in the coming week or two, week or two, <laughs> but um, I definitely... Um, I got this during a gray Thursday or Friday sale from um, Curl Mart and I, I had my hair straight for Thanksgiving but as soon as I went back curly this was the product that I used which was at the beginning of December and I have been using this product ever since except for um, today or not today but this last wash and go cycle I used Diva Curl but I just wanted to see how it responded but because um, I hadn't used it in a long time, but this pattern pusher, I definitely, it was my best friend in December. And it was my best friend in December too because, again, going back to the Insanity Max 30, when you're working out as hard as you do with Insanity Max 30, and when I work out, I sweat and all that stuff a lot in my hair, I need something that um, will hold the curls. Because believe it or not, even though I'm sweating and it may sound nasty, I still don't wash my hair or rinse it or anything every day. What I do use though is, I'll use a refresher spray such as Sultanicals Hair Sorrel. 
kink drink and I mentioned this in my um, in my haul as well and I just spray this in my hair and especially at the roots and keep it going and this kind of helps revive it and hold the curls that this was giving me so these two are really really good products and I've been using this now mind you let me quit lying this is really not a december favorite because i didn't get this till well i got it when did i get this mm, maybe like a week two ago no like yeah right at christmas but i've been using it i haven't used it a lot but i've been using it and when i've used it um I just like the way that it would it, it refreshed my curls and helped me, um, which is something that I've been looking for. I need, I've been looking for a good refresher that didn't have a bunch of glycerin and and other things in it, and that's what this is. It doesn't have glycerin in it. I wanted to try to go glycerin free and see you know the effects that it had on my hair for the um, winter time now that it's cold. But definitely um, try this product out and that is it oh one more thing that i did now this was a christmas gift and i liked it i actually got it before christmas i got a new phone i got the note 4 android yes i'm an android girl um but i love this case it's gold this actually well this is more gold than this but it just it's just all metallic -y gold and yeah i love it but anyway that's it that's my little december favorites video it's already been too long most of my videos are but i'm just excited that i'm making videos again all right so i will talk to you guys in the next one stay tuned and look forward to my insanity max 30 review look at some of the videos i have been uh, some of my videos were taken right after my workout explaining how i felt and everything and um, stay tuned because um, as January comes to an end, going into the beginning of February, so probably, like I said, for my January favorites, I'm going to talk about this. And stay tuned because I'm going to have results coming up um, for this program. I feel great. But anyway, I will talk to you later. Leave your comments below.